So you've seen these letters and are probably wondering, what is a DDoS attack and what happens when it's launched? Well, let's cut right to the chase. Here's DDoS explained in two minutes. DDoS stands for Distributed Denial of Service, and it's all in the name. The goal of such an attack is to deny service by creating so much traffic to a server that it stops being accessible to normal users. The easiest way to do that is to use bots, a slave army of devices infected with malware. Users can download such malware by clicking on simple phishing links. The malware gets onto a device and turns it into a zombie. The user is no longer in full control of it. The master of the botnet is. When the time comes, the master sends a request and all of these devices join the attack. They start sending thousands of requests for connections to the target. Most servers have very limited capacity, so such an attack can significantly slow down or completely crash them. Then the websites, databases, or other systems on the server go down and probably won't be restored until the attack stops. Does this cause any long-term damage? No, not really. But even several minutes without an important service, such as a medical or financial system, can be inconvenient or even dangerous. By the way, your computer, phone, or even smart fridge can be infected with botnet malware right now. To free it and help prevent DDoS attacks, take good care of your cybersecurity. Beware of phishing and use a good antivirus. I hope this video has been informative. See you in the next one.